Hi, hello, this is JCR. Today we are going to see another video tutorial on how to add dark brown filters in videos using Adobe Premiere Pro and so on. Let's get started. And here we are in uh, Adobe Premiere Pro 2019 version. If you want to follow this tutorial, just download the sample video given link in the description. Mm, and first of all, we wanna wanna duplicate this uh, video and then uh, turn off the top layer, select the bottom layer and go to HSL secondary and pick the if first we have to wanna desaturate the blue and blues and the greens and the background. First, uh, pick the blue color using this uh, eyedropper tool. Click on it and then go scroll down. You can see a saturation of 37 to 0. You can see some of the areas are not selected. And we have to use this plus eye dropper to select the colors which are related to blue. I will pause for this process so you won't get bored. Yes, we have desaturated it neatly. Now turn on the top layer and click on the layer. Now we have to remove the greens. So take again the eye dropper tool, click on the green color and desaturate it. Yes, the greens are desaturated. Then choose the blend mode from normal to light and color. Yes, you can see that the greens and blues are desaturated. Then select both the clips and then nest it out. Now click on the nested sequence. Go to basic correction. Reduce some highlights and decrease saturation. And add some contrast. And add some vignette to have a cinematic look. If you don't want, just you can uh, remove it. Just uh, turn off the tick. Then go to creative, add some uh, faded film to look more cinematic. And then again nest this clip. Yes, then finally go to creative. Go and change the look to Fuji Eterna 250D Fuji 3510. It's a Adobe inbuilt plugin. Click on that. Then you can uh, reduce the intensity to 50 and then increase the feather to something 20. Yeah, it seems good. And then reduce the saturation to 90 and then increase the vibrance a lot. Just 65 so that okay. Then go to curves and then make a basic S curve. Yeah. Now, the brown filter is ready you can see mm, this is the before this is the before video then this is after see lots of change right and that's all guys that's all about this today's video hope you enjoy it like it share it and do subscribe and if you are interested in photography or videography just check our Instagram page given link in the description and if you are interested in acting just direct message me via Instagram or email us and the email ID is given in the description also too and that's all guys that's all about this today's video and see you on the next one bye bye